Effigy of John de Beecham, 1st Baron Beecham, D.1388, and his wife, Worcester Cathedral John de Beecham, 1st Baron Beecham of Kidderminster, died 1388, was an administrator and landowner. He came from Holt, Worcestershire, and belonged to a cadet branch of the great family of Beecham, whose head was the Earl of Warwick. A favourite of the ailing King Edward III, in the years 1370 to 1375 he received several grants of offices, including the constableship of Bridge North Castle. He was elected for Worcestershire to Edward III's last parliament, January 1377, and Richard II's first, October 1377. Retained in the household, Beecham soon received substantial further patronage, and by 1384 he had been made receiver of the chamber and keeper of the King's jewels. That December he was granted for life the office of Justiciar of North Wales, to which was added in August 1386 a charter of liberties within his recently purchased estate at Kidderminster. Even though the Commons demanded in October that a new steward of the household be appointed only in Parliament, Richard II refused to comply, and in January 1387 he promoted Beecham to the stewardship. Beecham's rapid rise from Esquire to Baron could not be borne by the Lord's Appellant, who included his kinsman, Thomas Beecham, 12th Earl of Warwick. The latter probably saw the rise of his cousin as a threat to his dominance of the Midlands. Arrested and imprisoned along with three other household knights, Lord Beecham was impeached in the merciless Parliament in 1388 and condemned by the Lords for treason. Fortunately for his heir, John Beecham, 2nd Baron Beecham of Kidderminster, then aged 11, he had entailed certain of his manners, so these were exempt from forfeiture. 